Hey guys! And I'll see you guys next time where I see if a certain phone has any windows of opportunity. Yes, I kept that promise. So, here it is! I am dying on the inside. This is the Lumia 530 Windows Phone! Look at all these great specs! And yes, it's prepaid of course, on Walmart's network. Ugh, a Windows Phone? And it's on a Walmart carrier? I don't think those two negatives make a positive. It also wasn't easy to find this, ever since Microsoft announced that they will be ending support for Windows Phone 8.1. All the stores I went to that sell prepaid phones now only carry Android. Android, 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 Android. So I had to get this thing off of eBay. And if you can see the manufacture date, the phone's pretty old. But can it still be used in today's modern world? Hmm, let's ask Bill Gates. Okay, let's not. We'll just unbox it and find out for ourselves on today's episode of Board Smashing Grocery Store Phones. One Windows Phone joke wasn't enough. It's obligatory that I throw this Windows Phone out the window. <laughs> I really should have looked before throwing. Don't worry, it's a Nokia. Here's a first with this phone. Introducing the world's shortest micro USB cable. Uh, come on. This thing feels like a block of plastic. Ooh, the SIM card. We're just gonna pop this out carefully. Was that important? Uh-huh, uh-huh, uh-huh. This is hilarious. Hey, I got a joke for you. What did the dad say to his daughter when he told her that she couldn't borrow the car? No. Kia. <laughs> but no joke can ever beat this joke. <laughs> All right, let's plug her in. This is gonna be my first experience with the Windows Phone OS, and probably my last. Hurry up! Hello? Okay, there we go. English, United States, SIM error. Okay, I continue without it. All right, just gonna sign in first. Uh-huh, recommended, whatever, no, uh-huh. Another moment or two. All right, done, but it didn't take a moment or two. It took like three moments. No, how can you improve something that doesn't exist anymore? Close, whatever. <laughs> oh, it's my own phone's texting me. Now I know what it feels like to have friends. All right, home screen. Here's all the live tiles that everyone was fussing over when this first came out. I don't have any people, so there's nothing there. Just a bunch of shades of blue flipping around. There's not many apps installed, unlike those Android phones where there's like 30 apps installed. You can make the volume glitch out if you push both of the buttons. <laughs> photos, no photos. Sure, I'll snap some right now. And I just realized there's no front-facing camera on a 2013 phone. Cool. Also, I don't think I see a flash on the back of the phone, but there's a flash option right here. Does that do anything? Nope. The flash option is just there to show you that you don't have any flash. <laughs> Thanks. This is gonna be hard. Three, two, one. Got it. I would say that's decent quality. Okay, now let's do a video. Hey guys, right now I'm with the Nokia- Oh, it wasn't recording. I have to tap it again. Hey guys, I'm with the Nokia Lumia 530. Hey guys, I'm with the Nokia 
I hate when they put the speaker on the back. Let's take a look at the settings. Honestly, I like this swipe interface to get to different categories. Brightness, it's on high. And there's no slider, you can only choose between low, medium, and high. Project my screen, does this thing have a projector? No. How many gigabytes does it have? Wow, a whole three and a half gigabytes. And this phone has Cortana. Are you f***ing serious? To use Cortana, you have to have a Microsoft account? Really? Come on. All this effort to talk to a woman? Oh my god. Come on. I want to talk to a female! And now it's stuck on this screen. Forget it. I'm gay now. One reason that Windows Phone failed was due to its small user base, no app developer would want to make any apps or games for this thing. I wonder if I can use this as my daily driver. I have made a list of 11 apps that I use on a daily basis. All these apps are found on the Apple App Store and they're imported to me. So, I'm gonna check if the Windows Phone App Store has them all. I didn't check beforehand, so this should be interesting. Who knows? Maybe if the store has all these apps, I might switch over to Windows Phone. I'd rather die. And side note, apps that can be accessed from the web browser don't count. Ugh, this thing still has Internet Explorer? And also, third-party apps don't count either. Only apps from the original company slash creator. <sighs> All right, first up, YouTube. You guys probably know why that's important to me. And right off the bat, there's no official YouTube app. Off to a great start. Okay, Twitter, cause I need to know what controversial things are happening in the world. Okay, the store has Twitter from Twitter Inc. That's good. Check mark on that. Spotify because I'm too cheap to pay for music and I'm too lazy to pirate it. Okay, yes it does. Check mark for that. Instagram. I don't know if this counts, it says it's from Instagram, but it still says beta. Eh, I'm just gonna say it is. Check mark on that. And I doubt it'll have this, but Snapchat. This isn't really that important to me, but most of my friends use it, and they message me using Snapchat instead of the messaging app for some reason, even though they have my number, I don't know why. No, it doesn't have that. As I expected, Netflix. There is Netflix on this. Nice, I honestly wasn't expecting that. Oh, <laughs> I accidentally crossed it out. <laughs> Reddit. No, no official Reddit app. All right, next, let's see if it either has Uber or Lyft. If I'm stranded, it's good to know if your phone can call a ride for you, just in case, so let's see. Uber, well, there's no app icon, so I think it looks official. Does it have Lyft also? Well, it has Uber, but it doesn't have Lyft. We're still gonna give that a check mark though. eBay, for some reason, I barely use Amazon and shop mostly exclusively online on eBay. And there's no eBay. Closest thing is PayPal. And I forgot to write down PayPal, but I know that's there, so we're just gonna write it down and give a check mark to that one, too. All right, finally, Shazam. If I'm hearing a good song in public, I gotta know what it is, or else that'll haunt me for life. No, it doesn't. No, Shazam. Six out of 11, that's more than 50%. So, this phone is about half as useful as my iPhone. Pretty good, I was expecting less apps to be on here, actually. But can you even watch YouTube videos on this phone's browser? Internet Explorer? I've made a severe and continuous lapse in my judgment. Hmm. Well, yeah, I'll give it that at least. But it's still through the web browser, which sucks, so I'm still not gonna count it. And that concludes my testing of what apps it has. Who is Plain Rock124? Useless! Ugh. Hey Siri. Surely you're not serious. Uh, <laughs> this video is just full of great jokes. Now let's just move on to some other tests. All right, the first durability test this phone will go through is the scratch test on the boosted board. And this time we're gonna do a video. Come on. Okay, there we go. And let's go.
Oh, it kind of got flipped over. The white back did not do it any favors. The Nokia logo looks kind of cool now though. And it looks like the video's still going. We're just gonna stop that. Can I stop it? Oh, the screen is kind of cracked. Oh, I'm cracking the screen by peeling off the tape. If you could see, there's a crack going across the screen. Does it even respond to touch anymore? The damn thing's not even responding to touch now. Okay, the new award for the weakest phone on this series is the Nokia Lumia 530. Come on, it's supposed to be a Nokia. It's supposed to handle everything. Most of the screen was even covered by duct tape and the charger, so... How can it break that easily? I'm still gonna do the front facing scratch test. Hopefully it won't brick it. All right, let's go home now. All right, let's take a look at the final results of the scratch test. What a surprise, the screen is scratched. And if you can see, it's cracked way more now, here and here. Will it still power on? Well, I'll give it that, but I still can't swipe to unlock or touch anything. This phone failed already on the scratch test. Look at this, even more bullshit from this phone. I can't unlock it, so that means I can't approve it to import photos to my computer. So all the previous photos and videos I took, I can't import. I am labeling this phone as the worst phone of board smashing grocery store phones. The worst phone. Of course it's a Windows phone. Let's see if board smashing grocery store phones worst phone can survive, well at least still turn on, after a drop test. Worst phone ever drop test. Backside. Three, two, one. Still turning on. World's worst phone quarter drop. Three, two, one. The battery and back cover flew off. Yep, Nokia. The brand name doesn't mean anything to me anymore. All right, world's worst phone, screen down drop test. Three, two, one. What a surprise. It's even more cracked, as you can see. Still turns on though, but I still can't interact with it. Let's see how it will fare in a ludicrous drop test. Of course, it's gonna be boring since I can't take any video from the phone anymore. Three, two, one. <laughs> All right, it cracked some more unsurprisingly, but will it still turn on? It still turns on, I'll give it that. And still can't touch anything on the screen. The throw at a rock test. This test is exclusively for this phone. I felt the vibrate, but now the screen is dead. I kind of regret doing that. This is a lesson for you kids. Don't let your anger get the best of you. Now I can't even do a proper water test. There's your water test, folks. And it failed. WP used to stand for Windows Phone. Now it stands for Worse Phone. And since I can't do anything else with it, might as well skip to the destruction. Now, let's get some use from this phone. Thank you guys for watching this unexpectedly quick episode of Board Smashing Grocery Store Phones. 
and I'll see you guys later with Ford Smashing Grocery Store Phones, episode 10. Wow, I'm already almost at 10 episodes of this series? I gotta do something special next time for the first double digits. I'll see you guys later with that. Bye. Heh, <laughs> Windows phone out of a window. It's still funny. I should work at Disney Channel.